Hi everyone and welcome to our weekly love reading. So don't worry about labels, twin flame soulmate. Don't worry, just if this resonates, you will know. So I am going to use my XXX tarot deck today. And if you would like to buy this deck, you can do so on my Etsy store. But let's see, what do we need to hear? We have the High Priestess. So it is very important that you trust your intuition this week. It's going to be easy for you to hear messages from your ego. It's going to be easy to, um, you know, let your fears go into overdrive. But Spirit is saying this week, the more you can connect with yourself and, you know, trust your intuition, the more comfortable you're going to feel. You have all the answers you need already within yourself, but you need to find ways to access that information. So with a high priestess, it seems like you are being very mysterious this week. It seems like you're giving off this energy um, that you are, you know, hiding your emotions, almost like wearing a bit of a mask here because you're trying to be as patient as possible. This week, you understand that you need to be patient. It's as if there's not much you can do other than be patient. It feels like that's kind of like the only option here. So you could be in a situation right now which is moving quite slowly and spirit saying, look, it's going to be okay. But I need you to trust here. I need you to, to really believe that your patience is going to pay off. So let's see what's your counterpart's energy this week. The Wheel of Fortune. So your counterpart here is definitely trying to get things moving with a Wheel of Fortune. They're really hoping that there's going to be a change here. I feel like they've been dealing with a karmic lesson and they are finding completion in that. So, you know, your counterpart here is closing out a cycle and with that Wheel of Fortune, they're hoping that they get lucky um in the near future so they're really hoping to get lucky with money or just have a very lucky opportunity with you um i feel like your counterpart has been a little bit distant or um completely absent lately they've been trying to create this change within their own life and it feels like it's been very very difficult for them to do so i do feel like they have been um you know struggling to to get a get a break now, between you both, we've got the Ten of Body, which is a really good card to receive. So this is the Ten of Pentacles. So actually, between you both, it's as if you are both going to be working together on some kind of venture in the near future. Um, that Ten of Body is confirming that the two of you are entering a partnership. So it feels like you're both thinking of ways that you can collaborate, ways that you can work together to create something, to, to make something happen, to create a change or end a cycle here. Now, that Ten of Body, is a really big card of success so you are both entering a much more successful time in this connection so if it feels like things have been mysterious or uncertain that's okay because i do think here that you're both coming together to work on something um but we'll see what this is about let's confirm this You've both been experiencing some really big personal changes. So for the Divine Feminine, I feel like this is um, gaining emotional control, trusting her intuition, remaining patient. For the Divine Masculine, they've been experiencing um, changes with their relationship around money. And also like believing in destiny and closing out some kind of karmic cycle. Now, between you both, we've got the Six of Spirits. So... It seems you're both going to be spending some more time together really soon. So I do think that the more time you spend together, the more commitment is going to be made. So the Six of Spirit is kind of like taking a break as well. It's about you two spending some quality time together without other people being around and just experiencing this kind of romantic getaway, the two of you. Um, and as you do this, there will be a deepening of commitment between you both. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Two of Spirit. Taking a step back in order to decide what the next step is. That's what's been going on here, is that you've both been like taking that step back to have some time to plan where you are both going together. Someone here could have had multiple options, not to say multiple people. I just feel like 
like do I commit to this right now or do I focus on work like someone here has been trying to decide am I ready for this or do I need to explore my other options right now in my life um such as like travel or work etc so it feels like there has been a bit of distance here recently and the divine feminine has been trying to be patient with that um because it's the divine masculine who's most likely been trying to make these decisions um but you know take it as it resonates switch it around if it needs to be so the person here who's been having their options and trying to choose what to do next i do feel like they're making a decision i really do i think this person is able to see more into their future now and knows what it is that they want knows what they want to work on and they are really preparing that next step here and here's the three of hearts so this person would like to go on a date they would like to meet up with you spend some quality time together and talk about this so I have a feeling that they've made up their mind I do I think this person has already chose what they want to happen and they're going to announce this very soon. So there's going to be a big announcement from this person. Like, this is what plan I have in mind. And I'm wondering, um, can we make this happen? Um, I want you to know how I feel. Like, honestly, a big announcement is about to take place. So let's look into this a bit more. What is this big announcement? It's like someone says, like, hey, I've decided. I know that I want this the empress the empress okay so this big announcement i feel like it's gonna make you feel so powerful maybe you're the one making the announcement it could be um but the empress is the divine feminine this is you know such beauty is this nurturing energy there could be a pregnancy announcement coming up because the empress is that the mother so either a pregnancy announcement or like an announcement here where let's talk about family or it could just be announcing a new beginning so it sounds obvious but either someone's making the announcement to you or you are making the announcement because it's very very much involves you so i'm going to get a message from your counterpart see what it is that your person would like to say this week Let's see what it is that they would like to say this week. Yeah. Distance can't stop us. I share your pain. And let's see what else we've got. I promise to always love and protect you. So, yeah, we definitely have um, someone here who is saying, like, look, I promise that I'm... Are you coming join me on a reading for you? I promise that I'm always going to love and protect you. So I feel like there has been a, a difficulty here. There's been a separation or just a distance between you both because distance can't stop us it's like this person saying i know that we've been distant from each other but that's actually so that we can both work on things individually and in this time of distance i actually have been feeling a lot of the pain as well so it's not just you i've been feeling it as well Are you coming joining us Theo? come here you want to come say hello? Theo wants to come and say hello to everyone. You're picking some cards. So yeah, this person's saying, I've been finding this distance really difficult too. I've been feeling the pain in this distance. And I promise that I'm always going to love and protect you. I promise that this distance isn't changing anything between us. In fact, it's actually giving me the opportunity to see things differently and make the decisions that you've been asking me to make. So it does seem here like you have been asking this person, look, I really want us to decide what's going to happen next. You know, I really want you to make a decision what you see for the future here. And this person's saying, okay, I am don't worry about the distance because i'm using this time to think about what you've said and to make a decision and i'm going to announce that decision really soon so guys in the extended we're going to look into what this decision is 
you know, what it is that they have decided, how they're going to announce it, and we'll see what is coming next in this connection, won't we, little one? So do join me on my Patreon site, sacredspace.co.uk, for the rest of this reading. If you are resonating with this so far, then let me know in the comments, and we're going to see what the future holds here and what the announcement's going to be. So send you all so much love, and I will see you back here soon for another reading, but I'll see you over on Sacred Space for the rest of this one. Thank you.